Hello, this is episode 29 of Look and Learn on AD4 TV Radio. I am the Grammar Queen. In the last episode, we talked about words, their meanings, and how they came about. In other words, their etymology. In this episode, we'll be looking at words, expressions, and their pronunciations. C-E-R-E-B-R-A-L space P-A-L-S-Y is pronounced cerebral palsy, not cerebral palsy. Cerebral palsy is an early childhood disorder that affects muscle movement and coordination. F-A-L-L is pronounced fall. It means to move from a higher to a lower level or to lose balance and collapse or crumble. I-N-F-A-L-L, I-B-L-E, is not infallible. It is infallible and means never failing incapable of being wrong or making mistakes. It also means always effective. J-E-W-E-L-R-Y is a piece of ornament worn by women and men, like the earrings I have on now. It is pronounced jewelry, not jewelry. So please note, it is jewelry, right? Right. V-E-H-I-C-L-E is vehicle, not vehicle. A vehicle is a thing or medium by which things, goods, and people are moved from one location to another. When you owe someone money, for instance, you are in debt. Debt is spelled D-E-B-T. When pronouncing, the B is silent. Therefore, it is not debt, but debt. Please be guided. G-E-N-R-E -E is a style or category of music, art, or literature. It is pronounced genre, not genre, or genre. A set of connecting rooms in a hotel, guest house, or hospitality facility is spelled S-U-I-T-E and is pronounced sweet, not suit. S-U-I-T is pronounced suit and is an official dressing for both men and women. So note, S-U-I-T-E is sweet and S-U-I-T is suit. Thank you. That is all for this edition. I'll see you in episode 30. Till then, continue to speak right and write right. Bye.